All right, I'm here with an unboxing of the Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Works set for Dino Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. Uh, I believe this retails for $90, um, maybe $80, I should have checked that. Uh, I got this on Best Buy, Best Buy sent it to me, and I got it actually a little early, so I figured I'd do an unboxing uh, so everyone can know what they're getting into before they buy this over the Standard Edition. Um, pretty cool box, pretty minimalist. You got the Monado art. Um, nothing too interesting on any of the sides. Uh, the back kind of just tells what you got here. It includes the game and an art book. You can see it looks like it says there. And another spine. Uh, pretty nice box. Uh, thank you always to Best Buy who always sends their stuff well so it does not get damaged and it doesn't send it in bubble mailers like Amazon. Uh, I've taken the liberty of taking already on you know on cutting the seal at the top and taking out the contents from inside so we will take a look at those now um, this is what comes inside this really cool cardboard kind of book like thing with the Monado on it um, and we got this hopefully it's coming up on camera okay really nice uh, this is the case casing that houses the art book. So that is very cool. Art book is very nice. Thick for the most part for what you get with a special edition. Um, and it is hardcover. Uh, I'm gonna keep it sealed for now. I'm not gonna flip through it on camera because it might contain spoilers for the game for those who have not played the original version. Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition is an HD remaster uh, kind of a enhanced port of the classic 2010 Wii game. One of the best uh, JRPGs out there. Uh, very excited to play this one. Also inside, we have a copy, just a standard copy of the game, no steel book or anything. Um, so I know some people would prefer the steel book. I kind of prefer the regular. Uh, interesting, there they have a different back artwork. I know a lot of the Nintendo Special Editions, they take off the ESRB rating from the case. Um, I would assume this is not the standard back artwork for the game, uh, but very cool and standard spine for anyone who is interested. Uh, one thing I didn't like about the Xenoblade 2 Special Edition is that it came in a steel book um, with you couldn't with the game's name on this not on the spine, which was kind of annoying. Uh, but very nice special edition. I believe it's ninety. Um, I'm not sure. I just kind of snagged it as soon as I saw it existed because. Xenoblade is awesome, and the original is one of my favorite RPGs, uh, despite some flaws on the original hardware it was on. So, very excited to check out this new version. Um, I think that's going to be all for this unboxing. A bit of a short one. Uh, let me know if you're picking up this version or the regular version. I believe you can get the regular standard edition for $50 on Amazon right now. I think they're price matching that Walmart price. Um, so that might be something to consider as well if you don't want to, you know spend the extra money for this special edition it is just the game in the art book with a cool box um, so it is a bit of an ask but excited to flip through that art book later because i know it's going to be quite nice but there it is uh, let me know if you're going to pick up this game if you're excited for this game whatever it may be and i'd like to thank you for watching make sure to follow me on twitter at Objo gaming make sure to subscribe if you're not already subscribed uh, leave a like if you enjoyed uh, leave a comment down below and i will see you next time